Testing. 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 Lined up? Hold up. Damn, it's on. There we go. Perfect. Testing. 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 Hello, 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 hello. Hi. Hello, hello, hello. Hello? Dude, what the fuck is up with Twitch? Like... Jesus Christ, it is annoying. Like... Dude, I guess you're having CDM problems, but shit, fucking two days, man. You're a fucking professional company, like, fix your shit. Like, I can't load into jack shit.
volume mixer. I'm not dropping any frames, so I have no idea what's going on. Please work. Hold up. Um. Hold up. Hold up. Alright, hold on. Did I increase the gamma on the game capture before? Yes. Alright. Alright, I think we're gonna get started, um, Wednesday, 
Yes, Wednesday, 12, 12 p.m., April 15th, 2015. What up, guys? Uh, sorry about yesterday. I had uh, te technical difficulties on Twitch. Actually, I'm having technical difficulties still. Um, I'm surprised I'm even able to get the stream up. Um, I'm like having issues loading into my own dashboard and actually loading just streams at all from Twitch the past two days. Uh, surprisingly though, I'm not dropping any frames while streaming. So even if I can't load whatever, you know, Twitch streams, as long as you guys can see what I'm doing, not really an issue. Other than, you know, not being able to access the dashboard. It's kind of a pain in the ass. I guess as long as you're able to watch. Yeah, that's like the bare bones. We're going to be able to, to stream today. Um, We're going to be streaming until about 5 o'clock today. So I'm hoping to get in 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yeah, a good like five hours to count that with my fingers. Anyways, let's go ahead. I don't want to waste any more time. Visualization off. Turn that off. I'm about to load the game up. Play. All right, there's a game. Uh, let me turn off the music. Hold. All right. Let me see. Uh, so the last thing we did was we were working on Evergreen Mills, and I ran out of time. I had to kind of stop from there. But I'm gonna go back and finish that area up and then we're gonna hit up Vault 112 which apparently is part of the main campaign. I th think um, the Wanderer or whatever his dad apparently might be at Vault 112. Now other than Vault 101 I've experienced one more other vault which was I think Vault 108 I think it was 108 and that was because a lot of the the viewers wanted me to go there so we went there and I didn't know what to expect um I mean I don't mean to spoil it but it's basically spoilers playing this game in general or watching the game but we ran into a bunch of um I guess clones that I don't know, their names were Gary. I don't really know the lore behind that. I'm guessing it, it was just like a cloning facility or something. And they went crazy and they murdered everybody in the vault. And that's all I know, basically. And I guess every other vault has different stories attached to it. So, um, yeah, I don't know what, it, what to expect from 112 because it is a different vault. Anyways, and that's the only quest we have other than the three DLC quests and this one, which is we got to find a home for Brian Wilkes, which is the kid that we saved in, um, where was this place? I don't remember the name of the town, but it was kind of in the beginning. Uh, other than that, yeah, Vault 112. And on the way to Vault 112, we hit up Evergreen Mills. Uh, had a lot of raiders in it. There was a big ass Hulk guy. Um, and then we were looting the area and we ran out of time, which I already did mention. So we're going to go finish that up. I want to check out our inventory, make sure everything is organized before we take off. The machine gun. Frag grenades, frag mines. I think I'm gonna deposit some of the stuff. Okay, oh, I'm gonna put in the mm, pistol, 10 millimeter pistol. Uh, pistol. I think uh, we'll put one in. Cause 
Surprisingly, we don't have one. SMG also. Let me see. 10 millimeter SMG. I think we'll put this in also. Uh, we like to keep a collection of guns. Although, like, I'm holding them. Um, I still want to have a spare in the, the locker. Or storage, I guess you can say. Other than that, um, we carry around assault rifles for the, uh, for the Zhuanglong, Zhuanglong assault rifle right here. Which, we don't really use that often, surprisingly. Bottle cap mines, let me put that in. I don't really utilize mines. Flamer. I think I might just sell that because we have one in perfect condition right now. Frag mines, we don't need to carry that. Or a frag grenades. Missile launcher, we have uh two others i'm gonna actually take those out and then repair them and then we'll deposit them back in what else was there that was it um the sawed off i don't think i'm gonna use that because we already have a regular shoddy yeah we'll just take this one out real we'll all repair it and then then i'll put it back Okay, so let's repair. There you go. Perfect. Thought off. And... That's it. Let me see this assault rifle. Just hold it on us. Alright, put back the... Missile launcher. Oh, the Nuka Grenade. I don't want to take that either. We have two. Um, what was the other one? Yeah, the Sawed Off. And... Do I have any armor? Nah. What about to sell? I have a couple Dirty Waters. I'll put that in the fridge. Ripple oh. of the capital wasteland. It is I, three dollars. Pretty much it. Hear me and obey. Oh, sorry. That's that other radio station. Right. Dirty water. Oh, I think that's all I was gonna put in there. And now another Hold up. I know we have Wonder Glues. Yeah, let's just put that in also. Might as well. Also the turpentine. Um, the pressure cooker. I'll also put that in. Okay, and I'm gonna save it before we leave. Go. By the way, we are... We are... Where are we? Where are we? You look like a complete freak show in that mask. Hey, um, oh, I gotta go to this escape. We are 55 hours into the game. Thanks for listening, children. This is Three Dog. Ow! And you're listening to Galaxy News Radio. Okay, we're gonna go to... Let's go to um, what you call it, Green, this is Bob Crosby. Green Take something Mills. Don't remember. Home. Always forget the names of stuff. Every Green Mills. Yes. Burgles of all the build of reason will attack any human on sight. That's cool. Okay. I like how the slaves just kind of linger around here. Like, I let them go, but then they just kind of... They don't leave, they just chill. I don't know what's wrong with them. What do you mean? Get the hell out of here! Okay. Just pick up all the armors and repair. Okay, this is where we were. Let's go in here. Okay. 
So we, I think we cleared this area. We just have to... Wait, how come I don't remember looting this person? Well, how come I didn't? Alright, so we pretty much, I think we looted all the important stuff other than that body that we just came across. And the cigs. I think we looted everything in here. Well, except the armors, because I wasn't looting that. Because they're very heavy, but we have a good amount of space right now. So, let's go to the next area. I don't want to spend too much time here. Yeah, we already looted it. Alright, let's go. I think we gotta go to that door. Okay, Evergreen Mills a Bazaar. Um, upstairs. Did we go upstairs? I don't remember. I think we did. Yeah, yeah. We, we already went up here. Okay. Yeah, I remember this. Alright. What is that? <laughs> Look at us. Yo, this is how we play. Although I said I already looted this, like, we're still going in. Okay, we didn't go there. Because I got a key. Which kind of sucks because... Wait, the safe is locked. Okay, I guess I came here, but I didn't... No, I didn't... I guess I didn't loot this room. What? I could have sworn I looted it. Yeah, that's the stuff I wouldn't take. Yeah, we looted it. Maybe I just like abruptly left. That might have happened. I didn't even take that pistol. Okay. By the way, um, we just started, so I'm kind of expecting a crash to happen at some point. But we should save it more fre frequently. Okay. And let's do this. Am bottle cap pre war money exit. All right, let's go. Uh, we're gonna use the key on this door. All right, unlocked with storage room key. I think I picked that up the last time we played. There's another safe. Take the blood pack since we can utilize them now. Um, ammo box. Hold up, hold up. I think I need it. I'm gonna always save before we unlock anything because I usually do force lock now because it's quicker, but I don't want it to break, so I just reload the game if it does. But let me loot everything else. Oh, ah, holy crap! All right, we're literally fat man. Mark Cruiser. Alright. Yeah. Uh, armor is, is pretty heavy, but I guess just hoarding it around with the... With the weight is worth it, as long as you get the, the appropriate value. Like, 180 is not bad. I mean, it gets annoying to have to... Whatchamacallit... Uh, utilize your inventory, or like, organize it all the time. Oh! <gasps> Your bobby pins. But yeah. Uh, uh, and thank you for that. Alright. Loot everything and then I will unlock the whatchamacallit. The um the ammo box. And that might be it actually. We got one safe and an ammo box, so I'm gonna save it. Quick save. 
We're gonna do a force lock on this. Oh my god. Oh. Reloading. That's why we save it. Flame refuel. Um, I'm gonna do another save. Then we're gonna do another force, but I think this is 100%. I don't know if um, you guys ever noticed, but when you force a lock sometimes, it doesn't do the animation even though it's unlocking, which is kind of weird. I don't know, Fallout 3 problems I guess? Okay, that was it. Yeah, for that room. I don't know if I went this way. Yeah, yeah, we went this way. Yeah, we went this way. Does it, yeah, that was a broken terminal. Alright, we're gonna go to the bazaar. Bazaar. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Bazaar. In the state. Oh, I live in the States, so they don't really call it the bazaar. They just call it the market. Okay. This is new, so I don't know what this is. Alright, uh, no enemies nearby, start looting, 556, uh, shotgun shells, it was underground, alright. Okay, so what was the advice I got last time I was playing this part? Someone said that if I see... Oh, ink. Someone said if I see the vendor, to shoot him in the face. Oh. That was a good start. One shot, one kill. That was the first kill of the day. Taking it careful, alright? We don't go guns blazing. We go we go hypothetically or literally not once say literally hypothetically we go guns blazing with the uh, looting, but not with killing. The hell? She's like eat. It's like, oh who's that? And she was running away. Okay, there's one more dude. I don't know where you went. Anyways, we're just gonna loot until he swoops in, I guess. Yeah, I don't know where he's at. I guess this was their their bar area. Dude, look at that steak. Turn off this radio. We don't like Enclave. We're pro GNC. Let's see. Little box. Um, Karna Sigs empty. I don't know what the ham radios do. Like you activate it and nothing. First aid. Random pistol. Well, crappy pistol. I don't think I've ever shot the 32. The first impression I got of it was, oh, it's a crappy gun. I never used it, even though... I don't know what other guns use the 32. <gasps> yeah, we haven't got that for a while. Quantum? Let's see. We got a skull in a pot. That's pretty normal. Okay. That's it. Alright. Leave the bar or food area. Whatever this is. <gasps> he sees us. Oh my god. He got the jump on us even though we saw him first. Where are you going, man? Where are you going? Peek! Peek! 
All right. Oh, uh, so I know there was one guy up there. Not sure if there's more. Anyways, let's just make sure we loot everything. A 56 assault rifle, take all the armor, and we're overweight. Um, let's repair. Alright. 241 and 270. We're alright. Okay, let's go. Actually, yeah. The thing the thing is we got another fat man. This thing weighs 30. So you know it's called fat man for a reason. Literally, it makes you fat. Like you're slow as hell. 32. I'm trying to buy a little bit of room. Yeah. Alright, 232. Go. Let's go. Okay. This is like the cafeteria or chilling area. Okay. Blood pipe. Nope. Nothing of relevance. And he shoots some fat ammo. Yeah, the mini nuke, I've never shot it, but mini nukes are very valuable. I mean, in terms of money. Uh, but we'll probably shoot it at some point. By the way, how's it going, Swiss? How is life in... I know you're Swiss, but you're... are you actually in Switzerland? I don't think I ever asked you that. And if you are, yes. How is life in Switzerland? Uh oh. Oh my god! That scared me. Oh no. I wonder if an enemy's ever shot a uh, fat man. I'm not gonna go. We'll go loot her after. Um, a look at all all this stuff. Unless this is the way that we're going right now is the right way. Uh, maybe where she's at was a dead end. Should we have gone that way? Scrap metal. Oh! Oh! Those like sneak shots are amazing. Uh, no, I like it's not this gun isn't very strong against like harder enemies, but against like raiders and stuff. I like it because you barely have to use any ammo for it, and then it takes down enemies or easy enemies pretty quickly. Um, you know, but guns like the, uh, whatchamacallit, the Zwan Long, it's stronger, but it uses so much ammo. Okay, um, what's on these shelves? Potato crisps. One thing I've ever mentioned that, other than in the beginning when I didn't know what I was supposed to do to really heal myself, and I didn't really have very many stim packs. Oh my god, that looks legit. Um, yeah, I didn't have very many stim packs. I've never consumed any food, just because I knew. I don't know. I have this thing against radiation. I mean, obviously it's not good, but I'm sure eating a little bit wouldn't be very harmful. But, I don't know. That's just the way we are. Okay. Okay, there's the vendor. I'm not gonna talk to him yet. Let's go this way. We'll come back. We will come back. 
You know, every time we go to a new area, I like to make sure we cover the whole area. You know, like um, when a SWAT team goes in to clear a house, I like to make sure every area is is sweeped. That's kind of what we do. Uh, all right, so we're gonna go into whatever this. Oh, it's nothing. Oh, it's a dead end, and it has statues with red headlights as boobs. That's cool. Someone was very creative. Live as one lands quiet in my place in some woods and feels excited a lot and the life is somehow live is somehow expensive, but you get a lot of money so it compensates it. Oh so you live in a peaceful peaceful place but it's very expensive. Wasn't like Switzerland actually like a very Switzerland's like a pretty wealthy country, right? I mean, I don't know. I feel like it would be. Although I don't really have a, anything to really back up that statement. But that's cool. Like living out in... I would say... Yeah. Like I wouldn't... You're not in a metropolis. So, so they say. Very peaceful. But that's cool. Yeah. And I guess in a way, like, if you make good money, obviously... Either you're in the minority or you live in a very, like, wealthy area. But otherwise, Swiss life is good, sounds like. That's cool. What is this? Alright. I'm running out of space. Thanks for listening, children. This is Three Dog um, and you're listening to Galaxy News Radio. Cruiser outfit. Free Wasteland, and we're here. For yeah, you. definitely running out of space. Now, uh, I just repair this. Yeah, let's just do it. It's expensive, it's a rich country and you feel riches at some point, but yeah, I don't have a lot of crime. There's a robbery and a jewelry, it's a very big deal very big deal. Oh yeah, that's I think that's like my impression of uh, my impression too of Switzerland was that it was a very very friendly and wealthy country. I mean I haven't met any m mean Swiss citizens, so I have a pretty good impression. And you're a nice guy. But then I do hear like when there's jewelry store robberies or like bank robberies like even we hear that stuff over here like oh there was like a um whatchamacallit like in the movies like a high profile robbery or something on a jewelry store and it was like robbed for like a jillion million dollars or something like you hear stories like that once in a while yeah but uh i'm glad to hear life is good yeah, let's sell some stuff What's going on over here. Actually, let me save it. I don't know what to expect from this guy. Hey, good to see you again. What do you need? Good to see you again? How come I don't remember talking to this guy? Uh, what do you have for sale? Fresh out of the hands of some mark. Take a look. All right. Um, let's buy 308. Oh, look, yo, we're like approaching 10k. I don't know if that's good. I'm assuming 10k is a decent amount. It probably helps that we're very frugal and we don't really buy a lot of stuff. But we we basically sell like everything possible. Well, almost. Other than being a, ma a major hoarder, we usually sell stuff. Uh, Alright, I'm going to sell the assault rifles. Oh, I should sell the armors also. Um, yeah, let's sell this. This one. Except 66 more. Um, I'm gonna sell the helmet. Yes, 63. Yo, there we go. 10k. Guys, we finally reached 10k. We're Fallout 3 rich. Not Swiss rich. Fallout 3 rich. I'm just kidding. Um. Sell the flamer. 
What else? Laser rifle. Um, thirty-two. Uh, uh, I don't want to sell the Fat Man. I'm guessing Fat Mans are very good. He sells you stuff he seems friendly, but you can say he's a raider and he has a unique weapon, a shotgun, I think. But you have to kill him to get it. Oh, okay. So that's why. Okay, that's why I was told you gotta kill him. Got it. Oh, <gasps> hold up. Am I selling too much stuff? Alright, so yeah, we did. We sold one too much. Oh, should we kill him? I mean... We're basically following the good karma card. We're trying to be a nice person in the game. Just because it's our first playthrough. Um, so I want to stick to being a hero. Maybe one day we'll go back and do like... I don't know. Just do like the meanest stuff you can in the game. Oh, it seems like it would be fun, but that's that's another day. Um, but do I really want to shoot a guy for a shotgun and his name is Smiling Jack? I mean, if his name was like Asshole Jack, maybe, or Apple Jacks. Uh, I wonder if like if you kill him, do you get all his loot? That would be cool too. Let's buy all his stim packs. Alright, because we have some other stuff to sell. Let's sell... Parna Sigs. Um... I don't know why I have an empty whiskey bottle. Fission battery. Pack of Sigs. Yes. Um... Uh, Pre-war money. Yes. Uh... Sensor module. Yes. And... Accept. Now we're below 10k. We're poor. <gasps> We're poor. Yeah, yeah. I hope you choke on it. What? Bye. I don't even remember you. Your name is Smiling Jack. His gun. It looks like a regular. This kind of shotgun. Can we compare? Just stand there, okay? We need to compare guns. No. Oh! Hold on. What's going on? It looks the same. Except you wear it a lot cooler. Like I like it pointing down better. Ah, uh, he he grabs it from overhand, and we grab it from underneath. But it looks the same otherwise. You heard anything? Hold up. All right, this is what we're gonna do. I'm gonna kill him. I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna kill him, and then I'm gonna look at his gun. And if I don't feel like it's worth it... Oh, actually, it might be in his locker, huh? Okay, that makes more sense. First, let's loot. Loot. Uh, wonder... Wonder glue. Yes. Foot locker. No. Uh, that's it. Table. Oh, first aid. Dirty water, stem pack. That's it. All right. Now I'm gonna save it again, and then we're gonna shoot him in the f in the back. I don't want him to see it. I never knew it was us. Ah! What? Ah! I thought he would die. His head is crippled. You think? That's what it said. Did we get negative karma on that? I don't think so. I didn't hear the sound. I don't think we got negative karma. Roving trader outfit. Shotgun. 69 shotgun shells. Smiling Jack vendor key. The terrible shotgun. The terrible shotgun. Oh, it's better. Dude, it's like a lot better. Because his is in bad condition and it still does more damage than ours. And it's only like, only weighs three more than our combat shotgun. And we didn't get bad karma, so whatever. We'll take it. We'll take it. Unless it the aim sucks or something. 
Alright, uh... Where's locker? I'm guessing we couldn't lockpick it, huh? Yeah, it just says, um... Need key. It didn't say, like, lockpick. Easy or whatever. Okay, let's take all his... This is... This was his inventory of stuff that, uh... Whatchamacallit... Um... Um, when we can sell to him, I think. Like, his actual, like, store... So basically what we sold to him, we can just take it all back. That's cool. Take all the relevant stuff. BBs. Uh, the energy cell. What else should we take? He has two missile launchers. Alright. So I think what we're gonna do is I, I don't really want to leave any of the stuff. It's I mean it could it's money. It's basically money. So we're gonna take what we can and then go out and then come back in and then like basically clear out his whole locker as much as we can. And that's gonna take a little bit more time, but I think it's worth it, especially money wise. What else? Uh, let's take the bigger or heavier stuff. 20, uh, that'll be 40, 50, 60. 63 uh, We could repair it What else? Um, 75 The assault rifles I think these are the ones we just sold, right? Yeah Um, Hold on, let me do a couple repairs Weapons we have, we're carrying around three missile launchers. That's like full on Rambo mode. Alright. That's like a little bit over half, but you get 212 now. Um, assault rifles, let's repair. Uh, assault. Alright. 230. Terrible shotgun. Actually, I gotta see what this looks like on a uh, hotkey. Or actually, no, I'll just look at it first. It looks the same. Alright, so this is the terrible. And... This... Is a combat shotgun. I definitely see the difference. Anyways, it's better overall, so I'm gonna just uh, replace the hotkey on it. Bam. Oh, can I? Hold up. Can I repair it with the combat? Question is, is it worth it? 76% damage and... Wait, 76% condition and plus 20 damage. How much does the combat sell for? 148. Yeah, let's just repair it. That's fine. I don't care. Alright, 79. Nice. Like, we've been using the hunting shotgun since the beginning of the game and we finally replaced it. it took like 60 hours. Uh, what else should we take? Uh, we have a little bit of space. I'm gonna take... Um, let's go by value. Vision battery. Um, we can take these and repair them. Helmet. These are these are the ones we sold him. They're like in perfect condition, so we gotta come back for those. What else can we take? Take the 32 and what? Laser pistol. I think if we repair, we'll have more space. I thought we picked up another helmet. Hold up. This one. Uh, 15, no radiation suit. Yes. I actually might just store that one. Brass. Alright, exit. Uh, Alright, where was that hat? Okay, apparently you can't repair. 
with these two. But sorry, right, they actually don't weigh that much, so we're okay. Um, laser. All right, let's leave. Let's. Um, I'm gonna save it. We're gonna walk out really quick, and we're gonna port back to Megaton. We're gonna sell stuff, and then. And um, we're gonna come back. Although it's like kind of a long trek, but we'll be all right. We got time. Wait, if I remember how to leave. Okay, this was the way. And the other exit door is like right here, so we're okay. Exit. Wait, it was here. All right, here we go. All right. Um, let's save it again. Anyways, like I said, we haven't crashed yet, and we usually crash at least one time per play play day, I guess. I'm, I'm expecting a crash. You want something? Uh, it's already ten. The um, I think I know where we can go to um sell quicker. I don't want to wait for Moira. We're gonna go to, uh, the place with all the vendors. Actually, I didn't even have to leave there. Okay. Where was it? It was like, yeah, over here. Canterbury. Can I fast travel when enemies are nearby? What? I gotta help kill. Uh, hold up. I got you. I got you. Oh no. Oh no. Loot him. Dude, we're gonna be overweight. Whatever. Just don't disappear. <gasps> okay, we're gonna be overweight. I'm gonna pick all this crap up and we're gonna walk back in super fat and slow. This is how you make money. Alright? You're a hoarder. To the point that you can barely move. Let's go. I actually just take this too. Let's go. Alright. <laughs> Yo, imagine if you went this slow all the time in the game. Alright. What time is it? Still this it's still ten o'clock. Um uh, let's walk there first. Hello. Why are you so slow too? Hello. Are you overweight? You look kinda fat. Evening. Evening. God. So what up guys? How are you? How's it going? How's your day? Uh, I was trying to hit up the store right now, killing, uh, I don't know, I guess this is kind of wasting time. Trying to fill the void of walking to the store. Please hurry up! Dude, you can't even jump when you're fat. That's like real life. Is, is Walter here? Walter! I saw somebody. Is it the drug? The drug dude? Walter! I thought I saw somebody. Oh! He's here. Hey dude! Hello? Yo! Meth head! Buy my crap! Please! <sighs> it's you. I was hoping that you'd have moved on. What do you want? Um, hey Leo, can you hook me up? Someone told me there's a quest with this guy. What'll it be? 160 caps. All right. Let's see. Um, nah, we'll sell the heavier stuff first. Do the leather armor. 
Except, um, what else is heavy? Let's sell this. Doesn't really give much, so uh, we're able to unload more, I guess. Um, except, do the Sadist armor, sure, except, uh, I want to keep that, the trader outfit. We can be like, I don't know, I feel like we can be a future vendor if, uh, a being a hero doesn't work out. Partner Sigs, uh, let's sell the fission batteries. Um, I'm actually gonna buy a stim packs. Let's sell these and then pick up his stim packs. 165. Um, we'll also sell a carton of cigs, pack of cigs, all of them. 33. What else? Um, brass knuckles, uh, Chinese pistol. Combat shotgun. I think you have to talk to his sister or the doc here at Megaton to get the quest to send him to rehab. Oh, all right. Thank you, Swiss. I'll try that out. Let's do that after uh, we can start walking normal speed. Okay. Because if I got to walk this slow all the time, I think I'd kill myself. I mean, in game, you know. <laughs> Laser pistol. All right, we're done. Actually, let's sell the laser rifle. Bam. Ten. Alright! Enjoy the ride. Whatever. Anytime. Stop doing your drugs. Alright? Don't, don't, don't do your own stuff. Okay, let's talk to, um, the sister or the doc. Wait, is this Walter? Walter? I have scrap metal. Oh no, it's not. You guys look the same. It's not because you're both black. Okay. Talk to the doctor first. Doctor, hello. For Christ's sake, you don't look sick, and you sure as hell don't look dead. So why are you bothering me? Uh, okay, nothing about. Try to be careful. The Leo guy. So let's talk to the sister. I think I talked to her before, and she hasn't mentioned anything. Okay. Stop staring. Well, it's oh hey. Look, I'm not working right now. Hi! Nope. I can't. Come back if you need Maybe something. it's later. Yes, I'm uh, let's save it. I have this feeling we're gonna crash. Not that time. Okay, um, next plan. We're gonna deposit stuff. We're gonna put stuff in our collection, like the fat man and. There was a couple pieces of armor. <gasps> Hello, dog bait. All right, armor. Um, uh, radiation suit. Yeah, let's put that in. I wonder if you can run out of space in the lockers. Because it would suck if we do, and then I have to reorganize everything. Like, part of this game is, like, straight up just organizing your inventory. Roving a traitor. We don't have that. Maybe if you take the answer from the doc, tell me about the people. Oh, maybe. Let's. I'll do that. Cause yeah, I feel because we know that he gives a quest. I feel like I can't just let it go, which is kind of weird. All right. I actually would need to sell those. All right. Let's go to the doctor. He's not that far. I'll do that with the sister too. You guys see all of this? This is stuff I just toss on the floor for like the citizens. Cause they always come up to me randomly and like, Oh, you're our hero. We're gonna give you something and we've all like gathered up our money to buy it. And it turns out to be dirty water. You came in here on your own path. Yes. Okay. Tell me, what do you know about the people here? 
I already told you about the stall boy's drug problem. You said you wanted to help. That's about all the confidences I'm going to break for you, stranger. Oh, he just told us, but... Yeah. He doesn't... I really they, like, sending him to rehab? I don't know. Talk to the sister. I think she also said she knows that her brother's on drugs. Or whatever it is. He's on stim packs. Who is this? Andy? Can I help you? You again? Go bother Jenny or Leo, will you? I'm sorry to interrupt, Andy. I just had a few questions. Do I look like someone that you want to blow off? <gasps> let's let's do that. Strength. We're strong enough. Okay, tough guy. Say what's on your mind. Um, I can use some direction. You know, you're right. Nope, we've read the sign. All right. Is there a weapon dealer? Is there a bar? Can I rent a bed? Let's talk about something else. Oh, no problem. I'm not busy at all. Yep, plenty of time to talk to strangers. You were just sleeping. All right. Oh. Tell me about... Tell me about your brother. We can't ask him. Whatever. 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 He's just going back to sleep. Okay. Jenny. Where are you? He's not here anymore. If I don't... Yeah, if we don't see her, I'm not going to go actively search for her. We'll be back here a lot of times anyways. So, yeah. We'll... Hold on, let me save it. Uh, we'll just... We'll just do that. Let me slide to the doctor. We'll just do that uh, when we come back. You came in here on your own. Yes. Powers. Buy my garbage, please. Oh my God, he's poor. Never mind. Try to. Okay. All right. Never mind. Oh no! Don't talk to this guy. He talks way too much. Way too much. All right. Uh, we're going back to Evergreen. Hello, Sea Dragon. How are you? All right, Evergreen Mills. Let's go. Hey, let's go. Let's go. I'm gonna save it again because we love to save. Bust out our gun. Or all right. It's weird. I guess it's sound related, but. I always hear things, but I think it's just our own for uh, our own footsteps. Just got job with your followed by the missile last session. Um, you didn't. I actually didn't stream yesterday because I was like having. Well, first of all, something came up, but then I was trying to stream kind of later, like more. I was gonna stream for like uh two hours, but then Twitch. I've been having issues with it the past uh. Two days like since yesterday and today i'm actually having problems with it now like i can't load any streams like it gives me issues but fortunately i'm not having issues actually streaming right now so cross your fingers but yeah um so you did not miss anything okay i'm gonna leave everything now Let's go. So we're done with this place. Evergreen is finished. So that's it. Um, in terms of what you missed today, nothing. We were in Evergreen last time, and we came back and we finished exploring the whole area essentially. And the only thing that I got, oh, I gotta go back down. The only thing that I got from it was that. Yeah, kill raiders and loot. That was it. No relevant quests. No... I thought that maybe... Uh, maybe uh, Evergreen... Might be connected to uh, where our dad is at. Like the campaign portion. But nope. It's like a couple... I don't know. I can't really gauge the distance. A couple miles? I don't know. 
couple miles away. Did you free the big mutant outside? I free him every time in the cliffs and watch him beat all the raiders. Yeah, actually what happened was... So, I just kind of came here by coincidence, and then I was like, oh my god, there's so many raiders. So I pulled out my sniper, and I ended up actually killing, like, eight of them or something. And then, like, I think it was Zamboon. He's like, oh, shoot the, the electrical generator thing next to the gate. And I shot it and opened the gate up, and then this big-ass dude who looked like Hulk came out, and he just, like, started going ham. And he pretty much killed everyone. And then we had to deal with them after. Uh, we wasted a good amount of ammo on him, but... There was random mines all over Evergreen, and he was running on top of them and was doing pretty good damage. So it worked out. But that was pretty scary. I didn't, I didn't like straight on engage him. I kind of just went on the cliff and I was taking pot shots at him. Okay, so now we got to get to Vault 102, which is, I'm assuming it's right here because that's where it's telling us to go. And I don't think I can actually go from here. I probably have to circle all the way around. But that was the first time that I encountered one of those those big um, green mutant things. That was scary. Okay. So I'm walking all the way around. Unless there's... Yeah, I gotta walk all the way. It sucks because it's this is like I don't know, I guess a ravine. I think there are four or five big mutants in this game. That's it? Hmm. Yeah, that was the first one that we encountered. So I'm not looking forward to uh meeting more. Okay, let's go. We're out. What is that? Jury Street Metro Station. I, th that m I think that might be it. There's a house over there. Hmm. Vault 112 or... Do we go for a little trek to see uh what these places are? I feel like it might be uh, Jury Street. Yeah. Because the little triangle thing is solid on my on uh, the compass. But there's also a thing right over there, and there's a hollow triangle. Oh, and there's a freaking church. What is this? Alright, so if you've watched the stream, I'm sure you've come to realize that we always like div divert from where we were or originally going to go. Like, for example, right now I'm supposed to go to Vault 112, but when I see buildings like this, I always get curious. I can't really just, like, let it go or else I'm, like, bothered by it. What I mean by that is, like, oh, I wonder what it is type deal. Alright, we got an enemy. He doesn't... I don't even know where he is, but he doesn't see us. Oh, caution. Oh, it's a dude with the, a minigun, I think. Or a flamethrower? Yeah, it's a flamethrower. Oh! I mean, this was his house. Ram. Flamer. Flamer fuel. Leave the armor. Oh, by the way, I added, I started doing like um, a community, like if you see what Mpot said, like I started adding like community sounds just as a test. So like, I only added like two sounds and you guys can actually activate them. There's like cooldown and stuff, but if it's fun or like we enjoy it, I'm thinking about adding more sounds to it, which is pretty easy to do. So, I mean, you guys are free to, like, try it out. All I have is, like, uh, 
Yeah. Uh, two sounds from like Mario, which is like the the completion. Oh, mini new completion sound and like the game over sound. Evergreen big mutant is easy as no weapon whatever. He doesn't make that much damage. There are other big ones with clubs and whoop you if you're. Oh, you know what? I actually saw another um the giant mutant in um in front of the GNC radio building. I forgot about that one. Okay, random ammo. Oh, a spikes. Pressure. Oh, another pressure cooker. Alright. The hell was that? Oh, it was a gun. Oh, random bottle caps next to a uh, red skull. Alright, so it was good we came here. There was uh, two magazines. But usually when you- last time I went to a church like this, there were traps. I feel like this one. But I think it's disabled. Yeah, it's like disabled. Alright, I think that's it. Big clubs though. It's like big to him, but huge to us. Like. Probably oh, one hit kill. Okay, we're done with the church. Uh, let's check out... Oh, what is that? Yo, Zamboon, what up? Can't stay long, but I hope you enjoyed the stream. Oh. Yo, I would enjoy- we would enjoy a lot more if you are chilling, but don't worry about it, man. No pressure. And you didn't miss anything. I didn't get a chance to stream yesterday. There was issues. I don't want to get into it too much. Um, and we just started, actually I started like an hour ago, but all we did was finish up Evergreen and just do the loot, killed the vendor, took his gun, um, organized our inventory, and that was it. That was it. Yo, what up guys? Dude, my terrible aim. Do they only have melee? Like, yo, let's do this. Skyrim. Skyrim! Pain? Yup, you're in pain, brother. Oh, he let his buddy die. What in the? Yo, we're gonna, we're gonna melee the scorpion. These things hurt, dude. Oh my god. Alright, I'm gonna go sleep in the bed. Did I grab the bobblehead? There's a shopping with the teddy bear, I think, near you opening the shopping cart. What bobblehead? <gasps> what bobblehead? I didn't get any bobblehead. Yo, this thing is huge. There's a shopping cart with the teddy bear, I think, near you opening the cart. Alright. Are you talking about Evergreen, or are you talking about the church we were just at? I don't think the church, right? Okay, while you answer that, give me a sec. Um, I gotta use the bathroom real quick. Hold on.
right where I'm at behind the shipping container in front of you no I just got I just got here but yo thank you for really there's a bobblehead here this is so random let me go yeah let me save I'm gonna go back and sleep I don't want to I don't know get killed this practice our uh, Skyrim skills this is prepping us for Skyrim or New Vegas I don't know Or, uh, I don't know, this is like a Chinese sword. Okay, there's a bed right here, let me sleep. And then we're gonna go to the container and get the really, really random bobblehead. I can't sleep when there's enemies nearby. What? what are you talking about. Oh! <gasps> what in the. F Holy crap. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. What's up, this is we got this. Bow wow, and you're listening to GNR. That's Galaxy uh oh. Radio, <gasps> Yo, we're gonna Skyrim this. I'm gonna save. I'm gonna save it. All right. Let's see if we can do this with the. Uh, I think we have like ten dots of health. They see us. I'm hidden. <gasps> Oh! What in the? Oh! Get up! Oh my God! They got guns! You're you're cheating! All right, let's go. Hoop! Hoop! Ah! Yo, I want. I really want to stab her. What? Oh! That was awesome. New Vegas will be fun with melee. Oh no, I just like meleeing. It's fun. Uh, we have seven units of health. You guys don't hear like the heartbeat thing, so we're okay. I guess we raided their base, or they were coming to raid this base. I have no idea. Also, need to repair our sword. It's like jacked up. One hour. Very much human. So please, if you okay. meet one of the capital wastelands, um, goals, leave your prejudice we need to go and get the bobblehead now. Ah, yes. one important caveat, the kids. very random bobblehead. Those feral ghouls that prefer the dark dank underground, they are basically mindless zombies. So kill as many as you damn well please. Now, some music. Yeah, I get pretty careless with uh, our HP. Thank you for reminding me to heal and all that. I know you guys are just looking out. I appreciate it. You guys are like the guardians of the channel protecting us. Alright, so I'm looking for a shopping cart. Behind a container. Alright, shopping cart behind a container. Let's go. Oh, it's a teddy bear. Hold up. There's a shopping teddy bear, I think, near you opening the shopping cart. I remember the t open it. You take the teddy bear and open it? Is that what it is? Wait. So does that mean, like... I could open every teddy bear I found in the game? How do I open it? Like, break it open? Do I have to, like, break it? Alright, I got the- I got the teddy bear. So, yeah. Um, I don't want to do anything with a teddy bear until you can confirm. Like, what if I shoot the teddy bear and it explodes? What? You're joking, right? Don't scare me, man. I'm still hidden.
Yo, you're scaring me, please. Okay. I don't see a super mutant yet. Can we open these? Oh, they don't open. Alright, we're leaving. What do I do with the teddy bear then? Like, punch it? Ha! It doesn't do anything, you lied! That was a fake bobblehead. Alright. Um... We... we gotta... Unload. So let's go to, uh, um... If you take the bear, he hunts you down. What? Are you freaking kidding me, dude? Really? You guys want that to happen? Alright. I'm scared. I'm scared. Hold up. I gotta sell. I'm gonna sell at, um... Canterbury. Yes. You guys are joking, right? Like, he'll attack Canterbury if I stay here. You guys are lying. You guys are messing with me. Wait! Wait! Hold on! Why does she just pull her gun out? Holy crap. Oh, is the super mutant here? Or the big ass mutant? Please. Oh no no, it's a scorpion. Alright, I gotta help him kill it because we gotta... We gotta sell him stuff. Alright, you guys are like... You guys are messing with me. Because now I'm like, I'm playing the game right now, but all I can think about is a big ass mutant just appearing all of a sudden. Don't die already! See this, I'm looting this, but all I'm thinking is mutant. Oh god! Hold up, hold up. Damn it. Uh, repair. Okay. Wait! Wait! Looking for that special something? No, I just want you to buy our crap. If the clothes make the man, then here are the means to remake yourself. Um, let's see. 32 pistol. Yes. Um, we'll sell him an assault rifle. Yo, he has a thousand caps. Start heading towards Vault 112. Time to start the main quest. Yeah, yeah. That's where we were going. I was going there and then I got, like, backtracked because I saw random buildings on the map. That's usually what happens with us. Alright. What else? Um, oh, I forgot to deposit this. Alright, so the flamer. Missile launcher. Eh, not gonna sell it. I kind of want to go back home. Wait, this one is, um, speech, right? And this one's unarmed. I think I can read those. And somehow I have whiskey and scotch. And beer. I don't know. I have no idea where I got those. Alright. Hold up. We're gonna go to Megaton. I'm just gonna go to the, the locker really quick. That's it. That's all we're gonna do. Alright. This thing scares me. I don't like holding the teddy bear. I should sell it. I'm gonna sell the teddy bear to spite you guys. Satisfied customer. Walk well, friend. Maybe I'll like 
I'll sell it to Moira, and then then the the mutant will like kill Moira. I don't think anybody wants that. But uh, hello, Raze. Is it Raze Che? How's it going? Uh, Uncle Leo. Is he, wait, is he the mutant? Is he the teddy bear guy? Uncle Leo's the name of the giant mutant. I got it. All of a sudden, you'll get hit with the hydrant in the back. Wow. You guys, you guys are playing with me. Like, let's torture Emp. Torture emphasize. I'm gonna have nightmares of the the green, the big ass green mutant. I already seen it, so like, you know, I already know it's scary looking. Batman. I should take this one out and uh, repair it. And um, I don't want the frag grenades, missile launcher. We already have one. I actually could sell it. Let's just keep it in. I don't want to waste time. Bike knuckles. I should have sold that, but I'm gonna just put it in our inventory. And the fat man's repair that. Uh, uh, repair. Yes. Cool. Put it back. Batman, and we're good. 144. Exit. Save. The big super mutant is not Uncle Leo. Sure, Ray's. Sure. Here, you've done so much for us. I want you to have this. It's all I have to offer you. Nuka Cola. Thank you. No, thank you. It's better than garbage usually give us. Okay. Damn. Oh, that means if I go back... If I go back to Evergreen, I have to walk back out again. That's annoying. Let's just walk from the power station. Ah! Oh my god, it's the behemoth! Where's my gun? Why is there so many enemies here? Oh no, not this thing again. I'm all right. I'm never gonna teleport here again. This always happens here. Actually, I'm gonna let it kill them. Good job. Would you prefer the big fucker to say before that? Oh my god. One dude just ran off. Oh my god, he's being chased. R.I.P. I'm betting on he died. He ran like a couple steps and he died. Uh, should we loot? Oh, it's coming. It's coming for us. Oh, he's dead. Prepare for the big fucker. Alright. You guys suck. But yeah, thanks for the heads up. Thirty-two rounds. I just unloaded and like I'm looting all this crap again. You know what? Forget all that. Let's go. Did you already do Moira's quest? There are some perks you can get if you do all the optional stuff too. Um, yeah, we did all the survival ones. I don't remember if she gave us any perks. I think she did, but I don't remember off the top of my head. I'm pretty sure we got them because uh, we did do the quests. Dude, I remember the last time we ported here and we were walking to Vault 102, we ran into a death claw. I'm scared. <gasps> Please don't appear. Please. What is Okay, let's just go up the hill right here. Let's 
like chill music but I'm crying inside oh oh my god it's a death claw right right we're dead we're dead it has to be a death claw I actually recognize this boulder oh no is this a stupid dog that was a death claws uh pet pet dog we're gonna die now what is that bushes Damn. this one's are nothing against behemoth i just want you to be aware of that <laughs> thank you race we just ran into a death claw for the first time. Um our last our last game. And it scared the crap out of us. It actually almost killed us. So I'm expecting to I don't know, I'm guessing the behemoth is gonna kill us like tenfold. But thank you for the warning. It's weird because like I wanna know about these things, but at the same time, now it makes me all paranoid. Keep an eye out. Behemoth. I'm walking, but all I'm thinking in my head is Super Giant Mutant or a Behemoth. Behemoth. It's probably not even the right gun for this. Or we'll use the um the Zhuang Zhuang Long. <gasps> Alright, there's a building right there. There we go. Radiation. I'm gonna miss it. Oh well, it's been fun guys. I got a visa. Alright, Zamboon. Thanks for stopping by, man. I hope, uh, yeah, we see you later. Alright, there's a scorpion. I'm gonna take a pot shot at it. like stuck. Yo, just just stand there, okay? Just stand there. It's not doing a lot of damage. You know what? It might be bait. I'm focused on this and then the behemoth is gonna show up right behind us. I don't really know if he's on the wayside. I think a few are in the town. I hate those scorpions. Actually, I hate almost everything. Uh, thank you for that. Thank you for accepting the channel into your heart. <gasps> oh god, what's gonna happen? I'm gonna save it right here. Like the most random place to save, but... I'm bracing. Race for death. Okay, we're scouting. I don't see anything yet. Smith Casey's garage. All right, we're not there yet. <gasps> oh shit! I mean, yeah, we are here. I know the first time I played Fallout 3, I walked the wasteland and saw a mutant. I shoot him and just realize he just gets bigger and bigger as he's running towards me. Swiss, please, please. That does not sound legit at all. I can see through that. That definitely sounds like a troll. Troll. That's a that's a very trolly explanation. All right, I'm gonna um, scout the outside first, and then we're gonna go in the garage. Looks like it's clear. Twist, you are a funny guy. What in the?
What was that? I saw like something flying around. It looked like a freaking um bird or something. These things happen? Yeah. <laughs> What's up, chair? Is it Cheerdolf? Cheerdolf Sittler? Nice name, man. Welcome. Alright, uh, looks like an army base or something. But I saw a huge explosion, so I'm a little bit like. Hey, kiddies. This whatever. Is dog. Bow wow, your voice in the darkness. Or at least All right. radiation. I got I got an enemy to the left. <laughs> With the new Danger. Oh, it's a sentry bot. Alright, these are pretty hard, but we'll deal with it. There we go. Oh, yeah, this is like freaking tanks. She use a shoddy, huh? You can get close up and use a shoddy. Oh, shoot! Oh, I don't have any more AP. Alright, I need cover. Is this radiation? Wait for the AP to go up. Taking the teddy like you saw a mutant on the top of the hill. Oh god, we crashed. Don't worry, I just saved it. Alright, that was the mandatory crash. Single crash that we always get while we play this. Every day we have a minimum of... or. I would say maximum of a crash. I don't know if I'm jinx jinxing it. Good thing we just saved it. That's when paranoia benefits you. Because you save very frequently. Okay. There we go. We're here. Um, you should the rocket arm. If it's crippled, you can't use it anymore. Alright. Got it. Um, who was it? I think Zamboon said that you can use pulse grenades or something. And then, um... It does pretty good damage. I don't even I don't think I have any right now. I must have deposited them. Whatever. Okay, I'm not gonna go in there yet. Alright, I see another enemy. You can just oh, just normal. Alright, we got multiple enemies. I don't see them. Oh, here it comes. Oh, this is a just a regular rad scorpion. All right. That was another one. Don't move. Why is it gotta be six shots? Amp grenades make robots of scrap metal. Oh, do they? Do you mean literally scrap metal? Meaning scrap metal you can loot? Or like, it just like wrecks them if I have scrap metal? Because one dog Let's ain't enough again. and two is too low. It's me, three dog. How you can right, go back here. Got lots of stuff going down in post apocalyptia these oh. days. Here's some of the latest news. Where was the tent? Oh no, I hate this thing! The Brotherhood of Steel and their estranged brethren, the outcasts. Please die, please! Oh my god! Oh shit. And then there's a difference between plasma and M. I don't have any of those grenades right now, so. Okay, there's a tent. The rest of your brotherhood cats. Can't you extend an olive branch or something? You'd think fighting the super mutants would be enough. Thanks for listening, children. All right. This is three dollars. Keep saving. Alright, I see it. I see it. It sees us. It sees us. It's coming. Oh, it's almost dead. Up next, we have a public What happened? Listen up. This stuff's important. For all you guys and gals tempted by the thought of scabbing in the downtown DC, <laughs> here's a tip. This 
Did he die? Oh, it died. Well, uh, make the robots scramble and I think you loot one, two pieces. Oh, and we can sell them to Walter. Walter. Okay, five millimeter missile and scrap metal. Oh, well, we do have one. <gasps> Master Pi, what's up, my friend? What's up, buddy? Alright. Just in time, man. We're about to go into the... I don't know what it is. It's... A gas station? Or a repair shop? But I... It's apparently a vault. So... Yeah. Oh, what? What? You wanna... You wanna go full on Skyrim? Oh, he's a friendly. Where are you going? Wait! Okay. You've been having withdrawals from not seeing ya? Yo, I feel you. I've been having withdrawal from not, blah, 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 withdrawals from not playing. I didn't get to play yesterday because something came up and also like Twitch is being difficult. But <gasps> oh, man, if you're trying to say that you miss me, <gasps> I miss you too, dude. How do I get up here? Nope. The vault is so good, I won't spoil it for you though. Yeah, I have like... Everyone gets excited with the vaults. It's like, vaults are the highlights of this game. Or... That's what it seems like so far. If I've only been to two vaults, the one that we started... At and um, Vault 108. But yes, I'm excited. When I was told about the... When I went to Vault 108, everyone's like, Oh my god, don't spoil it. I already looked at this. It was like, Oh my god, don't spoil it. Like, something's gonna happen. And I was like, all paranoid. I was like, holy crap. Like, something scary is gonna happen. And then... It wasn't necessarily scary. It was just like... Oh, I gotta, I gotta go to the tent. It was like... Weird. Something unique. Yeah, that's that's the explanation I got too. Like all the vaults are different. So I'm expecting a vault full of Johns. Or a vault full of Michaels. I don't know. A vault full of behemoths. <gasps> oh my god. Yes, when you play for the first time this vault is pretty interesting. Are you talking about 108 or 112? All right, um, we can sleep. Might as well. Gary! Yeah. Gary Vault? That's like all I was saying throughout the whole vault. I was just like, Gary! Oh my god, Gary! And then I saw Gary 01. I think we killed 01. RIP. I don't know if he was the original Gary. And then like everyone was telling me about the lore of the game. About like how all the vaults work and all that. Uh, what up, Nighty Block? All right, we're going into the uh, whatever this is. By the way, everyone that's new here, are you guys all? I'm assuming you guys are all fans of the game, right? Obviously. I mean, I'm pretty sure you guys didn't come to see my mug, so yeah. Smith Casey's Garage. So are you guys like... Oh, Ink. Are you guys like hardcore fans of the game? Because most people are... The usual response we get is, Yeah, I've played like a thousand hours. Like, Fallout 3 is love. You came for some Fallout. Dude, you could have said you came to see my mug, but it's okay. Honesty is appreciated here. And uh, thank you for uh, accepting the channel into your heart, or at least Fallout. 
I'll take that as as a as a good reason. What the hell, man? I want to pull out my my fist. Stop it! Hold up, hold up. All right, I got this. I got this. I got this. There you go. Sometimes I get confused with the buttons. That's how you know, like, I'm not a pro at this game, but I'm a pro at having fun and uh, definitely enjoying the game. Right. And this is like the perfect game for, for me, at least, because I love scavenging for stuff. I got major OCD when it comes to finding crap. The hell? Alright. Uh, I love Fallout Franchise. Fallout 3, I have 200 hours. Nice. I think we're on... Um... Like, almost 60 hours. We're approaching 60 hours. This. So, we're like... Not... At, we're not... Anywhere close to you, but... It's okay, I got a 180 hour... Wait, 140 hours. Or the hell? Is something here that's like alive? Whatever. Anyways, you should collect the Nuka Cola Quantums. You don't find them often. Yeah, I've been told that they're um, nice to have, so I'm definitely keeping an eye out. They're the ones that we've uh, found so far, they're sitting in our fridge in Megaton. I think we have like 20 or something. And we have like 200 bottles of Nuka. Which uh, I've been told it's for a quest. And I did go to the Nuka Cola facility and we got the, um, the Nuka Cola recipe. I'll show you guys. Bam! Nuka Cola clear formula. And there's like a note that says, it's like here somewhere, um, let me find it, I want to show you guys. It's like a note saying like, oh here, I don't know. Here we go, this is what we found. Winger, Mercer, formula for Coca-Cola Clear is on the first floor of the DC plant. That's where they did all the R&D for it. That's what we got, the formula. This is get the formula and meet us at Red Rocket Tricycle Factory as we plan. I have yet to discover that place. I don't know where it is. And I'm assuming I use the formula and something's going to happen here. But, uh, um, yeah, we're going to do that whenever we find Red Rocket Tricycle Factory. Don't drink the quantums, Eb, you need them later. Nah, I don't drink them. I haven't eaten or like drank anything except for um stim packs. We're all about them drugs. We only take drugs. I've only eaten in the beginning of the game. Like right when I started, I didn't know how to heal. And we didn't have very many stim packs, I didn't want to waste them. Other than being a major hoarder, like I don't really use things either. Like, I like to be very conservative with the ammo and save all our money. Okay, that was it, right? Already looked in that. I don't think I looked in this toolbox. Okay, um, let me save it. Don't drink any of them, you can get addicted. Yeah, I haven't. I haven't drank any. And from what I gather, what I gathered from the plant, Nuka is very poisonous. Like, they killed a bunch of people just testing it out. Thank God, almost missed you, gonna save your dad. Anyways, hi, how you doing? I'm good, reverse, how's it going? Good to see you. Yeah, we just got here. Um, I gotta read those. I forgot. Or eat them, I'm sorry. We eat the books. Um, I'm guessing this is... Beach. Yeah. And let's read or eat this one. 
All right, cool. Let me save it. <sighs> yeah, all we did so far is we finished up um, what you call it, green. <sighs> always forget the name. Green something mills, the one with all the raiders. What was very dangerous? What do you mean? Is this the- are we getting close to the vault, guys? Alright, I'm gonna save it before we go through this door. <gasps> oh no! Oh my god! Hold up, legit save. Oh my god! Alright, we're gonna bust out um, our new shotgun. The terrible shotgun. Worst name ever. Where am I from? I'm from California. I mean, I'm from China. China. <gasps> Holy crap. Here we go, guys. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm not looking at the game, I'm looking at the chat. I'm using my peripherals. You can use the quantums for the nice bombs, you can find some blueprints. You don't need a gun. <gasps> oh my no, my no. Oh no. I'm excited and scared. Here we go. Oh my tits. I'm trying. Yo, I'm just trying to hype it up for you guys. Although you guys probably all know what happens. I'm the only one that's like... Like, in darkness. Alright, so it's a good sign there's no blood all over the walls. Like 108. Yo, this place is actually very clean. Look at the map. I want to see your reaction to this. Alright. <laughs> my reaction so far, my first impression is this place is way nicer than 108. Like, when I mean nice, I mean like not bloody murder everywhere. Okay, I see a friendly. I'm friendly, hello! Uh. Robot. Welcome to Vault 112, resident. According to sensors, you have arrived 202.3 years behind schedule. Please redress in your Vault Tech issued Vault suit before proceeding. If you have misplaced your suit, I am authorized to distribute a new one. Once dressed, please proceed down the stairs to the main floor so that you may enter your city lounger. Tranquility Lounger. Alright, I'm gonna turn off the radio because um, we want to get fully immersed in the vault. Plus, I don't want the VOD to get muted. Because, yeah, this game has a habit of muting the, the freaking... Uh, the music ends up muting some portions of the VOD. Okay, let me... Let me equip the vault gear. Full, full immersion. There you go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Perfect. Alright. Take a seat in the nearest available tranquil. Please take a seat. Hold on. Let me explore first. What if you open the vault and it was just a concrete wall? I don't know. I don't think it would have been as exciting. Warning, hydraulic catch, thirty three hundred pounds pressure. Where's our dad? <gasps> Papa! Okay, this is the right way. Let's go in third person. I wanna see... I wanna see our reaction. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. 
What is all this? This doesn't look common to uh, our vault, our home vault. Okay, before we go in the big ass room, I want to see what's around. Okay, I think this goes into the big ass room. Hold up. Check the map. Alright, it's telling us to go in there. I think we can go this way. Death pods? Alright, there's another robot. <laughs> Death pods? Hello? Hello? You have a sexy voice. Overseer's office. Hopefully he's a, he's a lot nicer than uh, our overseer. There's nothing else to loot? Really? I wanted to explore though. Oh god, hold on. There was an area that we didn't go to. Over here. I'm guessing there's nothing, but you know what? We never like to have any stone unturned. You know what I mean? Like, we, we gotta make sure every area is covered. It's like cleaning, man. If you clean a, if you clean a toilet, this is probably a bad example. If you clean a toilet and you miss one spot, it's still dirty as hell. Like, it's not clean. Okay, we're here. Is all this. They have a networking room. Hmm. Hmm. Is there anybody in these? Oh god. Hello? <gasps> Hello? Gary! Oh my god, he's watching TV! They're all- they're all watching the same stuff, okay. This door is activated elsewhere. Right here, okay. Hold up, hold up. This is back out, right? Yeah. You gotta go for a few- I'll be back later. Alright, master. See you in a bit. Okay, that's cool. All right, that's the only door. Okay, I'm gonna save it right in front of this door. The equipment room. No access, authorized personnel only. We're authorized, see? We're from 112. Open. I have a feeling the robots might shoot at us. I can get in a death pod? Let me try, hold up. Yo, easy. 100 science, straight up. One, two, three, four, five words. Let's get one dud and we're good. I always like to talk about this for nostalgic purposes. Back when, back in the beginning when we um, first hacked a computer, like our science was so bad, the entire channel was like helping to hack the computer. It literally took like 10 people to try to hack it. It is actually pretty fun. Bam. Easy. Well, one told security stockpile access. No authorized personnel inside the security zone. Open vault tech access hatch. Opening hatch in main garage area. Oh. Just in case I pull my gun out, hold R. What is all this? Bobby pins. Getting bobby kin pins is like winning the jackpot for us. And the stim packs don't hurt. 